Hey guys, it's Keith. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be playing the Stanley Parable demo, and I'm gonna follow that up by actually playing the real game. But I'm playing the demo because it's actually something different from. Oh. Oh, you sneaky bastard! I'm already playing. I thought that was a loading screen. I'm playing the demo because it's actually not the same thing as the game. It's actually additional content, so why not check this out? What's over here? Welcome to the Stanley Parable My number's 28. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you. Have a The cup? I can't pick up the cup? Nope. Yeah, I'm not waiting. Deuces! I don't need to wait for no 28. I got legs. Suck it. Is he singing? He's just singing while he waits for someone else to show up. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease. Just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The looming uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment? Just for 20 minutes or so. Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. No? Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Am I going somewhere? Yeah. Huh? Why don't I huh? take you on a little tour of the facility Ooh. and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. I'm realizing I should turn on subtitles. Where are they? Ah. Uh, how do you... Okay. Yeah, yes. Let's do this shit. No, not menu. Whew. That was almost bad. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Well, it's lucky for you, I already bought the full version. I guess I'm the sucker here. I can't jump. Or press things. Okay. I guess I'm going this way. <laughs> Get it? It's a corridor. Because ah, linear games are said to be in a corridor. Technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. I'm going over here. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Here's my Why choice of meaning and con consequence. Buttons to press and the consequences we'll I'm gonna stare at a corner for the rest of this let's play. You. I'm, f I'm fucking with you. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna make a video that boring. I'm not gonna just stare at a corner, but I'd love to. How fascinating! Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? Well, I'm out. You see, our choices Air really The next door has Aaron Hansen behind it. I'm out. Tangible nature. Of I'm not finding that. Fuck it. I'm out. No, no, this is bullshit. Wait, I said Aaron Hansen. That's the guy from Game Grumps. I meant Chris Hansen. I don't know. I'm making a pedophile joke. <laughs> okay. What else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. Those boxes look pretty wasted. Those boxes look pretty wasted. That whole wall looks pretty wasted. It's just a giant. That wall's especially wasted. It doesn't even have words on it. And that one. See, you're full of shit. You're a liar. I hate you. Faculty manager. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Just got me a promotion. I can't sit down. That nah, fuck it. No, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead. Give it a shot. I don't believe you. Oh. Hmm. I guess it's still in development. Right. Okay, moving along. My disbelief is well-founded. Shame on you. You need chalk. Haven't you seen Beetlejuice? You need chalk in, if you're gonna walk through a door, I don't know, in the wall. Like that's the only, or you need, or you need moon dust. But I'm not gonna spoil that game. 
How's the anticipation? Still feeling it? Ah, uh, it's the foe. That's the final choice. I guess that means I'm supposed to go there last. C. I see. Let's do demo status. This device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. The Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Does, is there a device that tells me whether or not I'm behind a video game demonstration device that tells me that I'm in a video game demonstration? Because that's what just fucking happened. Are you that eager for the demo to start? Don't worry, we're almost there. Oh, so you're supposed to, I'm supposed to think the demo's not happening. Uh, I hate to break it to you, but, I mean, Fraps is running, so I'm recording footage of something. And this is... compliments. It's like One I... of the most important parts of administering any Cut administration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. Is the is the smiley face upside down because it's a backhanded compliment? My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. Um, that's bad for you. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. I might be the only person playing this demo right now, because I'm, I'm like a few months late right now just playing this. Whoops. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no, you've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay, then. What's next? Well, what about... Why well, can't you compliment my amazing jumping skill, see? I, 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 this button does it, I know. I can, I can jump. I just... I... Don't, don't look at me. What's, what's down there? Whoop! Oh, I'm walking on the rail, shit. No, no, I'm going in there. Get in, look at, isolation chamber. Gimme, give gimme. Give okay, I guess that's not up. Walk into something again? Oh, there's a door. Look at that. Here is where there is nothing. In the main game, however, there are many more places where there is nothing. If you've enjoyed this experience of a finite amount of content, then the Stanley Parable may be just the game for you. I think this is my favorite room. Yes. Okay. <laughs> what is emotion booths? Is David Cage in here? Is he in every now, here's oh here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, step into one of them, and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Confusion. Now, now, we have to save at least a few emotions for the full game. Come on, that's Andrew's favorite booth. I need to show it to him for so he's near in spirit. Fear. Oh. I just beat Outlast. Suck it. Suck it. I beat Outlast, like, yesterday, and it comes out soon next. Discovery and despair. Well, I mean, I'm not an idiot. It was low, <laughs> and within the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides, the inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, the ref oh, that's an Obama. What? <laughs> it was low, and within German the accent. shame he carried that ocean breeze. Words did Saturday. Drift. The Sugary. Of the tides, the Buying the Stanley Parable. <laughs> kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause. Like a virgin. And there it is, the Obama. <laughs> what? Old a age. Okay. Discovery. Okay. Uh, those. Wait. What are, what are the words in despair? Where did these <laughs> cliffs go? You said hope. These crags Just groovy. That we stood upon. They shielded us from our own ignorance. Mot Spoke Wikipedia. Words and wrap up. Did you mix them up? Because Wikipedia should be in in Discovery, and there's like horrible things in here that should be in Despair. And I don't fuck it. <laughs> I'm out. Oh, you went in both booths? 
Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. Get it? Because video games are art if you put art in them, right? That's how it works? I don't know. Suck it, Ebert. You're dead. Important rules for properly administering demonstrations. Get right to gameplay. Okay. Give a brief summary of the game's plot rather than a full explanation. Okay. Hint at the first boss, but don't give away exactly who it is just yet. Make all cutscenes skippable. Demo should at least at last at least exactly. I'm bad at words. Demo should last exactly eight minutes. Player should not be confused. Uh, is that why you is that why you wouldn't give me the confusion booth? I'm embarrassed. Yeah. Uh -huh. What's in here? I'm going this way. Going. Oh. Oh, that's the exit. That's the decision. Okay. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. No! Uh, what are you huh. doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. Just let me through the fucking door. I thought I already did this shit. What do you want me to do now? Didn't I do the demo doors already? Exit. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Oh right, you were, that wasn't supposed to be the demo yet. That was him. However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, oh God, that's a lot. mental, physical, or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not uh, press I can't the red read fast enough. glowing disagree button at this time. I, uh, Nothing? No objection. Large red button. You're quite sure about um, that. This is it the cup? Oh, well, we're right then. In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. There's way Please too much ashtray. into the dance perimeter. Please perform a dance. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything oh, you see inside gone. the demo, Perform that dance, and I will terminate the demo immediately. Right. My, my dance is All called Alt F4. All been made. It is time at last. Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? Holy shit, White. I'm going this way. Is there a wall? There's a wall. There's a wall right here. Well, this is embarrassing. Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to Did the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number is 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Oh god, have you made Thank me do this 28 you. times before? Demonstration. Is it, am I stuck in an infinite loop? Is this Star Trek? Slash Groundhog Day? Slash okay, every yeah. other thing that did this plot? I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong in the first Whose time. papers are these? Can I read them? I can't read them. I don't know how to zoom. What is that? Indoors magazine. Clearly indoors. I get it. Okay, you know that no one is checking numbers, right? Ducks. You can just go. You could do it it's right It's just now. a magazine about right ducks. Second. I don't know how no one Everything's okay. We could be back at the demo by this time. Shut goddamn mouth. I already skipped the Are timer last time. This? Watching numbers tick down slowly. Well, please, don't let me stop you. If somehow you're associating the joy of this room with the joy of playing the Stanley Parable, then by... By all means, continue. The full version of the Stanley Parable contains all the ecstasy you are now experiencing and so, so, so much more. I will be, I'll be honest, don't know what that demo is. Yeah, don't know what that demo is. That's obviously Metal Gear Solid. Don't know what that demo is. I'm really bad at this whole famous demos things. Are you going to make fun of me more if I stare at this more? Oh wow, it's almost 29 already. Oh well. Moving on. Close the door. 
close the door. Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable demo take two. Finding the I demo, don't believe you. Learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes.